Imagine a dam higher than the Statue of Liberty and massive enough to hold more than 2 billion cubic meters of water. It's not a fantasy. This is Yusuf Ali Dam, a $200 billion Turkish megaproject that's breaking records and reshaping the landscape of the country's eastern region. Yusuf Ali Dam, which is going to break all the norms, is located 70 kilometers southwest of Yusuf Ali in the Artvin province within the eastern Black Sea region. Being the second largest dam within the Choro River development plan, it aims to build 13 dams. With a primary purpose of hydroelectric power production, it supports a 540 megawatt power station. But here's the thing that truly sets the Yusuf Ali Dam apart. As of 2023, it stands as the highest dam in Turkey and the fifth tallest dam in the world in double curvature arch type. Standing 270 meters above the ground, the Yusuf Ali Dam is an imposing sight that could possibly surpass the minarets of Istanbul. But it's not just the height that makes this dam stand out. The dam is strategically located on the Choro River, one of the fastest flowing rivers in the world, creating a staggering 2.2 billion cubic meters of reservoir, enough to fill over 850,000 Olympic swimming pools. Yusuf Ali is an ideal location that allows the dam to harness the river's immense power, transforming it into a renewable energy source for the region. The dam's design enables it to withstand the river's powerful currents, ensuring its stability and longevity. Isn't it remarkable in every way? Well, Yusuf Ali Dam is not like a traditional arch dam. In fact, it is a double curvature arch dam, a design known for its strength and efficiency. This design allows the dam to hold back an enormous reservoir, reducing the environmental impacts by using less materials than other dam types. But don't be impressed by its visible structure alone. Beneath the dam lies a 110-meter-long underground powerhouse equipped with three 180-megawatt vertical shaft Francis turbines. These state-of-the-art turbines are designed to convert the Choro River's rushing waters into clean and sustainable electricity. These shafts will generate enough energy to power around 1.8 million homes. The most impressive part is that the Yusuf Ali Dam incorporates cutting-edge seismic design techniques. Its foundation employs specially reinforced concrete and advanced shock absorbers, ensuring it can withstand even the most intense tremors. Talking about the Yusuf Ali Dam's surface area, it has created a reservoir area of approximately 33.63 square kilometers. This colossal reservoir has a total storage capacity of approximately 2.2 billion cubic meters. The dam's crest sits at an altitude of 715 meters above sea level, and the normal operating level of its reservoir is 710 meters. This mega project utilizes 5,800,000 cubic meters of concrete, 4 million cubic meters of body concrete, and 1,800,000 cubic meters of building concrete. To strengthen the structure, 70,000 tons of iron and steel products were used, including 61,000 tons of iron and 9,000 tons of steel. Being the highest dam in Turkey, the Yusuf Ali Dam significantly impacts the region, raising concerns about its ecological footprint. The dam's construction has led to the submergence of the Yusuf Ali Town Center and 19 villages, resulting in the relocation of at least 20,000 people. This displacement not only disrupts human lives, but also significantly alters the local ecosystem, potentially leading to habitat destruction for several species. Moreover, the dam's reservoir area of approximately 33.63 square kilometers poses challenges for biodiversity conservation and riverine ecosystems. It is predicted to affect 21 nationally listed adversely threatened plant species, including Iris touchia, all of which, except one, are endemic to Turkey. In response to these concerns, efforts have been made to minimize the dam's ecological impact. The project consortium, in collaboration with environmental organizations and local communities, has implemented various mitigation measures. These include habitat restoration programs, the establishment of protected areas, and the introduction of fish passage facilities to mitigate disruptions to the aquatic ecosystems. However, despite these efforts, the dam's construction remains a subject of debate and controversy. Environmental activists and local residents continue to voice concerns about the long-term ecological consequences and the adequacy of mitigation measures. Ongoing dialogue and engagement between stakeholders are essential to address these concerns and ensure the sustainable management of the dam's environmental impacts. While the dam is leading to habitat destruction, it's also bringing substantial benefits with it. 
particularly in terms of energy production and water supply. One of the major benefits is that Turkey's energy production will be boosted immensely, as 8% of Turkey's total energy production will be based on it. With an installed capacity of 540 megawatts, the dam supports a power station that contributes significantly to the country's energy needs. The dam is part of the larger Choro River Development Plan, which aims to build 13 dams, two of which are already operational. The dam's primary purpose is hydroelectric power production, supporting a 540 megawatt power station. With a total capacity of 558 megawatts, the dam is expected to generate 1.88 billion kilowatt hours of energy annually. This substantial energy production meets 0.6% of Turkey's annual energy needs. Impressive, right? At the same time, it will give the Turkish economy $268.8 million of added value annually. It will significantly reduce Turkey's dependence on imported energy, thereby saving foreign exchange. But that's not the end. The dam's total water storage volume of approximately 2.2 billion cubic meters not only supports energy production, but also improves water supply and irrigation in the region. The dam also aids in flood risk management by controlling river sedimentation. This aspect is crucial in protecting downstream agricultural lands from flooding and safeguarding the livelihoods of thousands of farmers. But wait a minute, there's more. This project isn't limited to building a massive dam. The Yusufeli Dam project also involves the construction of four balanced cantilever viaducts, including the 644-meter-long Tikhail Viaduct, the 695-meter-long Yusufeli Viaduct, the 340-meter-long Yusufeli Dam Viaduct, and the 530-meter-long Silankar Viaduct. These viaducts, along with the construction of 110 kilometer of roads, 45 tunnels, 22 bridges, and 92 culverts, showcase the extensive and intricate engineering feats behind this megastructure. Most importantly, the project is being handled by a consortium of Limac Constructions, Senges Constructions, and Colon Construction Company. Not only are they building a powerhouse dam, but they're also creating job opportunities for our community. How awesome is that? Today we've delved into the groundbreaking Yusufeli Dam project, a colossal endeavor reshaping Turkey's eastern region. From its towering presence to the intricate engineering behind its construction, the Yusufeli Dam stands as a testament to human ingenuity and ambition. But as we marvel at its magnitude and applaud its economic contributions, it's crucial to acknowledge the environmental concerns and social impacts accompanying such monumental projects. The displacement of communities and the potential ecological disruptions underscore the complex trade-offs involved in large-scale infrastructure development. Yet, amidst these complexities, the Yusufeli Dam offers promise. A promise of increased energy production, economic growth, and improved water management. As Turkey navigates its energy future, the Yusufeli Dam stands at the forefront, a symbol of progress and possibility. So, what's your take on how this mega dam will shape Turkey's energy and economy in the future? Are you optimistic about its benefits, or do you have concerns about its potential drawbacks? Share your insights and opinions in the comments below, and let's explore the multifaceted impacts of this transformative project together.